Well, more now on the controversy surrounding the new CCTV cars introduced to combat illegal parking on the streets of Bedfordshire. Last night on the programme, we saw how the cars drive around taking pictures using a camera mounted on the roof. Well, after the programme, lots of you got in touch. This from Joe Black. They are the new kids on the block in law enforcement. Camera cars, said to be six times more effective than a traffic warden. Using GPS and technology that recognises your number plate, it seems many Look East viewers have been caught out by these little yellow cars. Yesterday we heard from a pensioner who'd been ticketed for stopping on the main road while he closed his garage doors. And a wine merchant who'd been done while unloading stock from outside of his shop. Now Joan Smith from Langford has been in touch and tells us she too has been snapped, all because she pulled in to drop off her 91-year-old friend, who, by the way, is also called Joan Smith. We go for lunch once a week, don't we? Yes, yes. And um, it gets her out. But that car, taking my photo, stopped me actually pulling out. And I'm only a pension. <laughs> Well, lots of you have been writing in about this story. Martin Simons is one. He's a disabled driver, and he tells us that he's received a ticket from this car, but the photograph was taken from the back of his vehicle, therefore failing to notice the blue badge on his front windscreen. Then we have a letter from Duncan Hill, who says it's interesting that the council can magically find the funds to run this service when they're cutting elsewhere. He thinks the council should review its priorities. And David Beetlestone has also got in contact. He says he thinks these camera cars are a good idea. They'll save the pavements being blocked and the grass being spoilt by people who park in an inconsiderate way. Central Bedfordshire Council says checks and balances are in place. The footage is reviewed at the end of every day and those with problems can appeal. I think, Miss Smith, maybe you need to get out the car a bit quicker. What would you say about that? <laughs> I just have to jump out while it's moving. <laughs> She has to stop to let me out. She see? is nimble, you know, she gets straight out. <laughs> we do our talking before we pull up and then she's out. <laughs> Joan has now appealed and hopes this common courtesy hasn't ended up costing her £70. Joe Black, BBC Look East. The nimble Joan Smith and her <laughs> and friend, Joan Smith. <laughs> Joan Smith. <laughs> Thank Fabulous. you to everybody who got in touch. We always like to hear from you. Thank you.